Look, I'm so bored. I should go play M2 or some. What was that? Attention players! I just wanted to let everyone know. Roblox is hosting a new event. Roblox will assign you a soulmate based on your preferences. And you will have two months to guess who it is. The winners receive three million Robux. What the heck? Three million? Say less. Give me some sign. Choose your soulmate. HM. I like blonde. So yeah, blonde. Of course tall. I don't want some man shorter than me, duh. Uh, same style. Um, the rude one, please. I hope he's not a red flag. Generate soulmate. Done. I'm so nervous. Why did I think I wasn't going to get a soulmate? Lol, anyways. I need to find my soulmate. I'm going to ask the GC. Shut up, Louie. It's not my fault that those were the only two options. Oh, come on. You could have at least tried to make it possible for us to be soulmates. Why do you even care? It's just a dumb game. Sometime I feel like the moment you find your real soulmate, you'll break up with me. Babe, it's not like that. Alex, why are they fighting this time? They wanted to try and make the system choose each other as soulmates. But Amara's options weren't very good. For example, one of them was if their soulmate liked Adopt Me or Da Hood, and Louie likes none of those C. It's not my fault. We should probably leave. You're right. So what options did you get? Just the normal ones. Same style or opposite style. Brown or blonde. Tall or short. Kind or rude. And I got Barbie or emo. Not rich or poor. Huh. That's all the same. But those are pretty good, by the way. I think we should join Ragdoll. Because we might find our soulmates. Good idea. I think so, too. In Ragdoll. I don't see anyone look like my soulmate. Yeah, same. Hey, Boo Boo Bear. Cutie patootie. You are so cute. I think you're my soulmate. Ugh, you sound like nine? I hope not. Gosh. Uh, don't be mad at me like that. Maybe we really are. Wait, I got a clue. Phew, it said. My soulmate is over 15. Uh, whatever. You're boring anyway. Damn, that was close. Haha, <laughs> imagine if she was really your soulmate. I can't even imagine that. I feel bad for her soulmate. The? Maybe her soulmate also nine? I don't know. Maybe we have to do another way to find them. ABC, if you have blonde hair, the same style as me. And you're looking for your soulmate. What are you doing? I'm looking for my soulmate. In this way? Uh, yeah? ABC, hey, beautiful. Oh, uh, hi. I perfectly match the description, baby. That's great, but please don't call me that. My name is Iris. Oh, getting flustered, right, baby girl? Bro, back off. She just said she's not comfortable with you calling her that. Shut up. Who the hell are you? He's so annoying. Maybe we can go somewhere private and you can give me some gulp gulps. Beg. No, please don't do this. I just want to find my soulmate. Attention all players. A new update is here. Everyone will receive a certain amount of gulp gulps. If you give someone some gulps, then you can see if they're your soulmate or not. Oh no. What the hell? Get ready, beg. Alex, help me please. Oh my god. Please don't make me do this. What do I have to? Fine, fine. Oh, you want some too. Fifteen minutes later. See? You're not my soulmate. Thank goodness. Ugh, whatever. That was horrible. I think that's enough searching for one day. For real, let's go back to the GC. Hey guys, sorry we were fighting earlier. It's fine. Yeah, as long as you've worked it out now, we don't have to worry. I hope you'll find your soulmate. Yeah, thank you. Even though I don't want that, really. Because I already had Diana. Ah, thank you, babe. Oh, another sign about my soulmate. Cool. What is that? Wearing a pink necklace. Normally, boys rarely wear pink necklaces. I mean, they can wear pink shirts, but pink necklaces are a bit rare. Yeah, I think so too. Oh no, don't tell me. What the hell is that, Alex? Did you forget to turn off your deep dark web fantasy history? The hell? No man, I mean, 
It's not. My sister is texting to me. I don't know why she's spamming, but... Boom. Uh, guys, could I add my sister? I think she's 14. Is she fine? You think? Yes. I don't mind. Let her in. Okay. Hey, bitches. What's up? Louie? What? I was just saying hi. You better be. Who are you guys? LMAO Helen. This is my GC. Yeah, yeah, I can see that. Anyways, guys, I'm Helen15. And maybe some stupid can't even remember my age, so I must say that myself. Hey, it's just a small mistake. So, no face, Rev? No, we are not in a fucking Roblox lock story, duh. Okay, why is why she, so, she mean? so mean? Anyway, I'm Iris15. Diana15. Blue is 16. You all know already, but Alex 15. Wait, are you guys twins? Oh no, I'm adopts. Oh, I'm so sorry for asking. No need to apologize. That's a normal thing. Your fit is super cute, by the way. Oh, um, thank you. You're welcome. And being, and being nice, nice right, right away. away. So has anyone found their soulmate yet? No. Not yet. I still can't find them. So I... Hey, Iris. Can we talk in private? Just two minutes. Oh, okay. Wait for me, guys. Okay. What happened? I feel like I'm being too overprotective of Louis. But I can't help it. I love him so much. I can't lose him. Even when he just talked to another girl. I get jealous immediately. I'll admit even when he talks to you sometimes. Plus, I think I found my soulmate. But I don't know how to tell him who is it. What? Where do you find him? Some guy from the hood. He matches all my preferences and clues. I also match his preferences. You didn't give him any gulps, did you, girl? Of course not. I'm not a cheater personally. I think the best thing is to just tell him the truth. He should know your true feelings. What about my soulmate? And Louis, he might break up with me, girl. And I don't want that. I can't live without him. Listen, girl. This is Louis we're talking about. He loves you so much, even when he doesn't show it. I think you should just tell him that you found your soulmate and work something out together. Maybe that's better than this. And stop overthinking, okay? That's not good for you. I get it. Thank you so much. What would I do without you? No problem. Now go get him, girly. What were y'all doing in there, girl? It's none of your business anyways. Have you guys found your soulmate? Louis and Alex haven't. I wish, but no. Have you, Diana? Actually, yeah, I'm sorry. Louis, you know what? You were right. It's just a system. We shouldn't stop dating just because we found our soulmates. I really love you and don't want to lose you. So please, when you find your soulmate, don't leave me. OMG, so this is your true feeling for me all that time? Yeah, I'm sorry, babe, I... No, no, no. Don't say sorry. That's all I want to hear. I love you, and I also think like you. OMG, um, really? Yes. Forget about some stupid soulmate. I just want to be with you. We don't need to do as the system said. I have my own life, and I just want to stay with you. Aw, oh, I'm going to cry right now. I love you too, babe. OMG, what was that? Yay, I'm just going to claim my Robux. Aw, oh, you and Diana are so cute. Congratulations, you two. Aw, oh, thank you. By the way, I have to go for a while. I need to tell my soulmate about my boyfriend. Maybe we can discuss together. Okay, then see ya. Good luck. Yeah, bye. They're so cute. I know, right? Yay, I just got a clue. By the way, how so far I've gotten no clues? LMAO, bro, I've gotten seven clues today. Make that eight. Damn, I only got one. My soulmate has a black necklace. Mine said my soulmate is wearing pink and has blonde hair. Sounds like Barbie. Shut up. There are not many boys wearing pink with blonde hair, you know? I don't know. Maybe he's special. I hope my soulmate is nice. So maybe we can become friends. Think she'll want to be friends with you? Bro, you're literally adopted. Why would your soulmate even want to meet you? Well, at least your parents chose me. Meanwhile, they had no choice but to keep you. I'm back. Hi, Diana. So, how's it going? Well, my soulmate also had a girlfriend, so we settled on just being friends. 
Phew, I'm happy to hear that. Now that Diana is back, wanna play a game some game? The Hood? Can we play something else? Since we always played the Hood Angle. Yeah, the Hood is getting kinda boring far. Let's play MM2. Oh my god, I love MM2. Same, I play all the time. Okay, join me. What? what? A, girl? a girl? Wait. Uh, uh, before you go, I need to tell you something. Oh, really? Cause I also have something to say too. Oh, okay, you go first. I'm lesbian and I think my soulmate is a girl. What? My soulmate is a girl too. It just told me in a clue. You're lesbian? No, I'm bi. Did you get a clue? Yes, it said my soulmate is bi. I'm starting to think you're my soulmate. Dang, me too. Well, there's only one way to find out. Shit, I've never gulped a girl before. There's a first time for everything, right? How many gulps you have? Infinity. Dang, that's too much. Anyway, come on. I can't wait anymore. Okay. 15 seconds later. Oh my god, I can't believe you're my soulmate. Male Roblox made it so easy far. I didn't, I didn't expect, expect my, soulmate my soulmate to be a girl. To be a girl. Actually, Actually, as soon as, as, soon as, they, as they said she had, she had blonde, blonde hair and wore, and wore a pink, pink necklace. necklace, I have, I to, have know to know it. it. Silly, Silly me. me. Um, hello, are you okay? Oh yeah, I'm fine, haha. I'm just a little distracted. Okay, so let's claim a Robux. Want a match? Of course, baby. Oh, I'm sorry, I didn't mean it. No, it's fine. Aw, oh, thank you. Where are those idiots? They surely just left us. Let me go ask my sister, bro. Why didn't you do that earlier? I forgot, bro. Hurry up. Okay, she's coming back. Uh, hi, guys. Where were you? Yeah, we waited for a long time, but y'all didn't show up. Wait, why are you guys matching now? So to put it simply, a uh, girl, just tell me. Helen is my soulmate. What the fuck? So your soulmate is my sister? I'm so sorry, Alex, and to everyone else. I never told you, but I'm bi. Don't even apologize. Yeah, we'll always support you. And Alex? I'm sorry for how I reacted. I'm not mad about you being bi. It's just I can't imagine you being with my sister. Oh, well, we're not dating. Not yet. What do you mean? I really like you, Iris. I know we just met. But honestly, I've never experienced love at first sight until I met you. Wow, I don't know what to say. Maybe, well, I don't know either. But we need to take it slow. We just met, you know. Even though we are soulmate, but I'm not feeling anything yet. <sighs> I guess you're right. Iris, preve chat, please. No, bro, she can speak for herself. Well, I'm her soulmate, and I'm saying she can't. Alex is probably going to tell her some shitty fake story about me just cause he's jealous. Alex, is this true? No, please. Don't tell me. You're going to take my sister's side. Alex, don't lie. Well, see? I'm leaving. I can't believe you do that. What? I can't believe you didn't even notice what you did wrong. Helen was clearly making Alex uncomfortable, and you just took her side and told him to stop. I'm really sorry. Don't apologize, babe. They're just gaslighting you. Um, don't call me that. We are not lover yet, and I'm going to talk to Alex now. Hey, Alex. Huh? Why are you here? You probably think I'm jealous of you and my sister dating. No, I believe you now. I know you wouldn't get jealous of me. I just want to ask. What did you want to tell me before? Well, I just wanted to say, be careful around my sister. She has a mental disorder, which she's making it really obsessive over people. For example, if she finds someone she really loves, she'll go crazy over them. If she feels that there's anyone interfering with the relationship, things will get messy. Oh yeah, although she only does it out of fear abandonment. You know, because she's adopted. Well, thanks for warning me. By the way, if I really so start dating your sister, promise me things will not get awkward between us. Well, um, I don't know. What do you mean you don't know? Look, I... Oh shoot, the GC is spamming. I guess we have to go back. Yeah, you're right. Finally, y'all back. 
Sorry about that. It's fine. Well, Iris, will you be my girlfriend? Bro, y'all just met like five minutes ago. Shut up, asshole. Uh, Helen, I think. You don't like me back, do you? It's not that. I just don't. <sighs> do you think we're moving a bit too fast? Oh, but I really love you. Wait, why don't you guys date for a few days so Iris can test them officially date? Wait. Why is that actually a good idea? All right, then let's do it. Well, a date? I'll think about it. But not now, please. Because I'm kind of busy. Oh, okay. Just tell me when you're all ready. Okay. Sometime later. So do you find your soulmate yet, Alex? Unfortunately, no. Oh, so. But I think I don't want to find them anymore. Because my heart is not in their place. Huh? What do you mean? Well, I'll go fast. Listen, Iris, maybe you'll think I'm crazy or whatever. But I really like you. Even though I know you already had a soulmate. And your soulmate is my sister. Wait, wait, wait. What did you just say? Slow down, bro. You're too fast. I, I'm sorry. Because if I speak slowly, I will continue to fidget. I just want to speak frankly to ease the pain in my heart. After seeing Diana and Louis still love each other, even though they found their soulmates. So I thought I might have a chance if I tried. But I'm afraid I'll turn into yes. a fool. Because my sister is very beautiful. What was that? I said yes. I like you too, Alex. Oh my god. For real? Yes. The reason I'm so hesitant with Helen is because I already like you. Finding a soulmate is just because I want Robux. But I don't hate her. I think we should just be friends. In fact, I've liked you for a long time. But you idiot only pay attention to stupid jokes and don't pay attention to me. Ouch. I'm sorry. But haven't you spoken your heart out now? So I guess we can go public now. I'll talk to Helen. OMG, me too. I still can't believe this. Haha, -ha, but you have to find your soulmate and tell her about this too. Of course. So in the end, everyone found their own soulmate without following the system. Everyone's life is very short, so everyone should just do what their heart tells them to do. If it's legal, the end. I'm like 100% sure I wasn't, but whatever floats your boat. Yeah, whatever. Bruh. I want to play bad business. Join me if you want. Oh, now what? Now, get on my message. I need to talk to you. Yeah, what is it now? Why do you go silent? Why do he go silent, Lola? Huh? Silent, who? Danny, what the F are you talking about? Harry, I'm talking about Harry. He had something to say about everyone else in the group chat but not me. I was the only one he was dead silent for. I was told you. I told you. Before this, I literally told you. I said, what if he thinks I'm ugly? And guess who is right this time? Okay, but your is you immediately. Jump to the worst possible conclusion. There could be a multitude of different reasons. Why Harry went silent and you'd still go for the negative one. Look, I know we're trying to be all wise and insightful. But shut up and be in my shoes for once. Bruh. The group is face revealing. Everyone looks so amazing. Then your turn rolls around and Harry goes dead silent. No comment, no rape, no nothing. His comments weren't even compliments. It was like not bad. You're telling me I even get one of those? Well, let's just ask him why he went silent. Is your brain all in one place today? I'm not asking him anything. God, I shouldn't have listened to you. What the F was I even thinking? Derek, we don't know if him going silent was even a bad thing. No, you don't know if Harper going silent was a bad thing. I know damn well it was. Derek, just calm down. How the hell am I supposed to be calm? I'm about to implode. Meanwhile with Harry. What the F am I supposed to do, Mark? Well, he's gorgeous. <gasps> well, based off of what Derek said when you face revealed, I'm pretty sure he thinks the same about you. Hard to say though. He was saying like that to everyone. If he found me unattractive, he probably wouldn't have said anything anyways. Well, don't go around with the mindset that he thinks. You're ugly because you're not. I don't think you have anything to be worried about there. You're probably right. God, this is so annoying. <coughs> Trust me. Watching it from the outside is ten times worse. How the F is that? I have to watch you physically restrict yourself. From pining for Derek every time you're around him. Remember when you slipped and called him cute. Don't remind me. Bruh. I know that little didn't have to clean his room. I probably just skate him off. 
Well, either way, don't worry. I'm like the best matchmaker of all time. Oh, we're going to need a miracle because I'm 90% sure Derek isn't into me at all. Don't say that. Have at least a little bit of hope. I'll try, thanks, Mark. Yeah, no problem. I'm going to pop in the group chat and see if they're playing anything. Hey, guys. Hey, Mark. Hey, Harry. Yo, where's Derek? He's, he's busy right now. He won't be online for a while. A while the final while. I honestly don't know. Sorry. Well, hopefully he comes back soon. In the meantime, who wants to play? Me? Can we play Outlaster? Yeah, of course. Join me. Lola, a word. Is Derek really busy or did something happen? He's just busy with school and stuff. Don't worry. I might have believed you if you hadn't said school. We both know Derek couldn't give a less about school as long as he's passing. Be honest with me. What happened to Derek? Look, Harry, trust me when I say, I wish I could tell you, but I can't. This is Derek's personal situation. If I was able to tell you, I would. To be completely honest with you, me and Derek aren't exactly on speaking terms at the moment. Wait, what? The F did you guys get in a fight or something? Yeah, again, I can't say about what. All I can really do is wait until he's cooled down enough to speak to me again. And I sadly don't know when they'll be. I've never seen him blow up like he did. Well, I won't tell the others about this, but just make sure he's okay. I'll try my best. A couple days passed. Have you and Derek made amends yet? If we did, he'd be in the group chat with us right now. He hasn't been returning my texts. How bad is it? Are you on radar delivered? Red. Oh my f***ing goodness. Yeah, I know. Was the fight really that bad? It's been two days. It is hard to explain. I just, I don't know Harry. I want to say he's overreacting, but that's just going to make him shut us out for longer. You don't have to give me the details, but at least give me a clue of what the fight was about. I might be able to help. To put it lightly, I urged him into doing something he was a little uncomfortable with him and it ended up backfiring along him. He's really shaken up over it. What the F did you make him do? Again, I can't tell you, Harry. Derek would never speak to me again. Lola, I swear to God. <coughs> Look. I didn't force him to do anything. I suggested he step a little out of his comfort zone. And it didn't even technically backfire. He just thinks it did. You know how Derek can get. He sees one little thing and starts spiraling. Well, the rest of the group chat have it bothered texting him. But I'm going to see if the little will talk to me. Derek, Derek where are you? I know you're not talking to Lola or whatever. But at least talk to me. Wait, how do you know about that? Leela told me you guys got into an argument or some like that. If you're worried about what I held, you don't have shti to worry about. She refused to tell me what the fight was about. She didn't tell you. <coughs> you don't know anything. She didn't tell me jack squad. All I know is that you guys got into an argument. You freaked out and now, you've been in mute for two days. I've been wondering where you were. I was going to come back soon. I just, I need a time to think. Time to think about what? It's complicated, I can't tell you. Jesus Christ. Not you too. Bruh. I'm sorry, Harry. It's just really personal. I can't tell you, not yet. If it's that personal, then fine. I won't push, but you can't hide away forever. I know, I don't plan to. It's just this is so annoying. Harry, I have a question. Ask away. Okay, but don't make fun of me for this. Danny, I'm not going to make fun of you. Huh? What's your question? Okay, so, if you had a crush on someone, and you were with this so pretty much every day, so there was no avoiding them. And they thought you were ugly. What would you do? Is that what this is all about? You have a crush on someone and they called you ugly. Harry, you said you wouldn't make fun of me. And I'm not. For sake? I was just asking. Anyways, I wouldn't freak out over it. So what if they think you're ugly? There are millions of other guys out there who think otherwise. Don't get your panties in a knot. Just because one in a billion thinks you're ugly. Easier said than done. Harry, it's not one in a billion for me. I'm gay. My dating pools are the size of a puddle. And besides, I can't just move on. I like him. I see him every day. Does he go to your school or something? Yeah, we go to the same school. I see him in the halls a lot. Oh, well, in a case who gives us a shti. He's just some nobody seeing the halls. From the son of it, you barely know him. He's not offering you anything. He's not doing anything for you. You got nothing to lose by forgetting about it. But I can't just. God, you don't get it. Yeah, you're right, Derek. I don't get it at all, because neither you or Loa will tell me anything. 
I'm sorry, Harry. I'll just give me a while. And I'll be back in the group chat good as new, promise. Yeah, I'm right. You're not getting away from me that easily. Not getting away from me that easily. Harry, it's fine. No, it's not Derek. <coughs> You've been completely out of contact for two days now. It's not just fine. It is though. I'll come back right now. And we can pretend this never happened. They don't know why I was missing anyways. They just think I've been busy catching up with schoolwork. Yeah, well, I know you haven't. And besides you really think you can just waltz right and act. Like nothing happened. What about Lola? I'll go apologize or something. Just pretend this never happened. Derek, don't. Jesus Christ. Lola. Well, if it isn't Derek, did you have fun with your three days temper tantrum? Bruh. Or are you back to yell at me some more? Look, I know I'm really sorry. I shouldn't have freaked out like that. And I shouldn't have gotten mad and blamed it on you. It wasn't your fault at all. Well, at least you're self-aware. I'm really sorry, Lola. Please forgive me. I'll do anything. Get this over with and tell Harry you like him. Almost anything. I'll do almost anything. Then tell me what went down when Harry texted you. I want to know how badly you fumbled. Well, he texted me telling me to knew that me and you fought. Then you got on my case about me being bombed for two days. And he asked me what this was all about. And of course I didn't tell him. I told him that I had a crush on someone. But they thought I was ugly. You told him you had a crush. Who did you say it was? How did he react? I kind of maybe sort of told him that it was some random guy in the halls I see a lot. Lola. My patience for you is running so thin right now. Bruh. I'm sorry. I don't know what you expected. You know, I wasn't going to tell him. I know, I know. What else did you say to him? That was pretty much it. I tried crying where it fall out of me, but I ran to you. So, I was escape the plan. I didn't mean it like that. I really am sorry. I just panicked. You can't know the real reason. Yeah, I know. What do you plan to do now? Huh? What do you mean? I mean about this whole thing. About Harry going silent about the supposed guy in the halls. Do you plan to just sweep it under the rug? And run away from it like you always do? Well, what can I do? What is there to do but continue on like normal? It's not like I can just go and tell him that. I made the guy up and it's not like I can change how he sees me. If he thinks I'm ugly, then I guess I just to live with it. I can try and get over him. Get over him? Who are you? Because you're definitely not my Derek. My Derek fell in love with a stranger at summer camp. Because he offered him a bag of pretzels. And was heartbroken for two years. Because the guy actually lived in a different state. You said you would never bring that up and I didn't say I would. I said I can try. Yeah, good luck with that. Hey guys. Oh hi Derek, welcome back. Long time no see Derek. Are you done catching up with your schoolwork? Lola said finals were really stressing you out. Oh, hum, yeah. It was really stressful but I'm fine now. That's good to hear. Now that we're all here again we should play a game. What should we play? What about a horror game? In honor of Derek being back. I'm down. Yes please. Of course. Alright join me. They play a random horror game for four hours? That was so tedious. Yeah, especially the part where we had to get the scrolls. It was scary though. Barely, maybe for the first chapter. Don't even get me started on the maze part. Why do all Roblox horror games have to have some huge random maze part? It's so annoying. Exactly. We could have finished so long ago without the maze. Well, I don't know about you guys, but I'm exhausted. I'm going to hop off. Same here. I've gotta help my mom run errands tomorrow. Good night, guys. I'm honestly super tired too. Good night. Harry, I know you're not asleep. Yes, I am. Bruh. No, you're not. I'm here to check up on you. Check up on me for what? <gasps> Don't play dumb, Harry. You barely said a word all night. What's going on? Nothing's going on. I'm just a little tired as all. Just tired? <laughs> That's what they all say. You've been eerily quiet since Derek came back, you know. Does this have something to do with him and don't lie this time? And what if it did? Then, we need to talk. What's going on? I thought you would be excited to have him back in the group chat. Yeah, well, you thought on. I talked to him last night. About what? About why he had been gone. Apparently we weren't supposed to know. But him and Lola got into a fight. They fought over what? Over some guy. Then he liked some random guy from his school. Apparently Lola told him to introduce himself. As something like that and the guy thought he was ugly. Bird brain probably needs glasses. 
Derek likes some random guy. So he left for two days. Sorry. I'm just trying to understand. There's nothing to understand. I never stood a chance. I have known. The next day. Hey, guys. Hey, Derek. What's up? You guys want to play? I'm super bored. Sure, I'm down. Me too. Same here. Whatever, sure. <gasps> All right, join me. They play hell last for an hour. I was so close, no way. I literally got voted off in the first round. And the guy of redemption was a sweat. Well, that sucks, but I personally enjoyed that very much. Yeah, because you won? Don't be a sore loser, Derek. Oh, shut up, Mark. Bruh. Oh, and Derek, what happened to that guy that kept following you around? He sent me a friend request. Did you accept? Not yet, should I? Do it, see what he wants. All right, let me go do it. I accept it, now, we wait. Well, I gotta go. I gotta drop my brother at my dad's house. By Mark. By Mark, be back soon. See ya. What do you guys want to do now? I'm down for anything. Me too. What about Judy? We never did the second chapter. Yes, sure. All right, join me. They play Judy for three hours. While they're playing, Derek gets a message from the guy he accepted earlier. All right, it slides out for me. See you guys tomorrow. Same for me. Good night, guys. Then, I guess I'll hop off too. Good night, Harry. Good night. They all go offline one by one. As they're all logging off, Harry notices Derek is still online. Hey, you're Derek Wright. The one and only. Who are you? My name is Alex. I'm in your fourth period class. Wait, Alex, how do you know it was me? You were talking Miss Savannah in the lobby. And your display name is literally Derek. In my defense, the homework she handed out is going to take like two hours to complete. My anger is valid. Yeah, I'm just not planning on doing it. Do you think I could get your number? Every other message we send is getting tagged. And it's super annoying. Yeah, sure, my number is. Alex gives Derek his number and they text over a message. Okay, way better. Yeah, thank God. Anyo, are you going to do the homework now? Nah, probably not. Bruh. I have until Friday anyways. And Derek, that homework is due tomorrow morning. What? You're joking, right? Nope. You don't actually pay any attention in that class, huh? This is supposed to be done by tomorrow. Oh my god, Ooh. I don't even know where to start. I can't let my grade drop any further. I've gotta get this in. Calm down, dude. It's really not that hard to do. She just makes it out to be complicated. Here, facet me and we'll get it done. Alright, thank god. I own you big time for this. Derek and Alex facet me and go over the project. It's take until 5 a.m., but they managed to finish it. I'm so tired right now. I'm not even sure I'd want to go to school. Derek, I did not spend all night doing this project with you. Just for you to not come to school and turn it in. I'm going to go shower and get some breakfast. You should get ready to. All right, all right, I'm going. Don't forget to convert the slides into PDFs. Okay, bye. Derek manages to drag himself out of bed and to school. His present is project just fine comes home exhausted. Oh my god, that is literally just not true. I was just lagging. Maybe I'd believe you. If that wasn't your excuse every single time. Hey, guys. Hey Derek, what's up? Nothing really, can we play something simple today? I'm really tired. Yeah, sure. I found this game I want to play actually. Really, what's it about? Join me and find out. They play a random tycoon for an hour. All right, hopping off early. Derek, what on earth has got you so tired? For God's sake, it's like five in the afternoon. Yeah, you're literally never this tired. Well, remember that guy that friend requested me last night. Turns out he actually goes to my school. We were talking about this project. And he offered to take time for me and help me and it took literally all night. I'm so tired I could pass out right now. Which is why I gotta hop off. I need to go to sleep like as soon as possible. All right. Well, good night, Derek. Night, Derek. Good night, Derek. Mark, before you start, let's not jump to conclusions. To be continued. Wait, the GC is spamming? I'll join. Hi, y'all. Hi, Annie. Wait, why are you matching with Tiff, babe? Uh, I'm not. Well, do you guys know what day it is? Saturday. Oh. Jack, wanna play a game together? Of course. Wait, babe, can I join? Sorry, Annie, two-player, Abby, ha, ha Bye. Are you okay, Annie? I know, he's your boyfriend. Yeah, I'm okay, I guess. 
He even forgot my birthday. He has never remembered it. And we have been together for three years. Happy birthday, Annie. Thank you. Annie, want to play a game? I can't right now. Why? I gotta go. Where? The hospital. Okay. Well, see you later, Alex. Bye. Annie. Mom, I'm ready. Okay, sweetheart, come downstairs. I'm here. Okay, let's go now. Pretty sure it's nothing serious. Yeah. Hi, you guys are finally here. Hi, any last time you did some blood tests. But the doctor was Amelia. Yeah, I remember that. We got your tests back, and it turns out you have epilepsy. Is this serious? No, we are just going to put you on medication. Okay, so I can live a normal life. Yes, but you might have to go to the hospital a few times. Okay. You guys are free to go home now. Okay, bye. At home. Mom, I'm going to go to my room now. I'm going to go on Roblox now. In game. I'm a join Alex. Ha, huh. why has Jack and Tiff blocked me? Alex, 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 Alex. Yeah, Annie. Do you know why Jack and Tiff blocked me? Well, so a few minutes after you left, Jack and Tiff joined back. Tiff told us you told her to leave and stay away from Jack. Jack trusted her and blocked you but I know Tiff was lying. Because she has always been jealous of you and Jack. Oh wow. I knew she was jealous, but I never thought she would take it this far. Yeah, she did take it far this time. Is there any way we could get revenge on her? Hmm, I don't know. Oh wait, I have the perfect idea. What is it? Okay, so you could change your avatar to another boy. And change your name and voice because you know how. Easy Tiff falls for people. Yeah, that's actually not a bad idea. So she will fall in love with you and Jack will drop her. Perfect. So our plan starts now. Okay, so go change your avatar now. Okay, I will be right back. Wait, one thing. What's her style? I don't know, but it's not preppy. Okay, be right back. Is this good? Yes, but what would your name be? Max. Perfect. Now you need to change your voice. Mom in this. Yay, that's fine now. We need to find Tiff. She has her joins on. She's playing Da Hood. Okay, so I can still be in a game with her but can't friend her? Yeah. Okay, let's join. Alex, Max, and Annie join Da Hood. I see her over there. Wait, but what do we do? She's not gonna let you join. She going to let me join if you say. You're not gonna join unless I join too. That's a smart idea. I know right, but she's going to fall for it because she's dumb. True, now let's go over to her. She's alone. I think Jack left. All right. Unlock you again. Oh, who's this? My friend Max. Hey. And why are you here again? I just wanted to ask why'd you block me. Oh, haha. -ha. Did I block you? Yes, you did, but why? I must have blocked you by accident. Oh, okay. Can you unblock me then? Um, yeah, I can. So, Max, how do you know Annie? Well, I met her again. So, do you want to join my GC? Yeah, but can Annie come? Okay, I'll add you guys. Tiff added Max and Annie to the group chat. Is there another person in this GC? Yeah, but he's not online. Oh, okay. Wait, Annie, please private chat me. Why would I? Just do it for me, please. Fine. So, what is it, Tiff? Can help me. I like Max. Why would I help you? You're mean and plus you're with Jack. Yeah, but I'm going to break up with him. What do I get out of this? Because I'm not doing it for free. 60k Robux. Deal. Okay, so what do you want me to do? Okay, so since you know Max better than me, you're going to get me information about what type of girls he likes and that stuff. Hmm, but for that type of information, I need more Robux. Fine, how much? 60k more, so 120k total. Why do you need so much? Because I need that amount. So do you want information or not? I want the information. Okay, but I need the Robux first. Okay, fine, but promise me you're going to get the information. I promise I will go talk to him when we go back to the GC. Okay, thank you again, Annie? Yeah, yeah, no problem. Tiff sent Annie 120k Robux. We are back, Max. Marcus private chat me. Okay, so? Tiff gave me 120k Robux for me to get information. About what type of girls you like. 
So what's your plan? When we go back, you ask her to private chat, and then you will ask her to be your girlfriend. If she says yes, you come back, and I will get Jack to the GC, and he will her cheats, and after that, you're going to break up with her. Okay, got it. Let's go back now. You guys are finally back. Tiff, can you private chat me? Mind, is it finally happening, OMG? Tiff. Um, yes, I can private chat you. So I wanted to ask you this for a while. Tiff, I really like you. Will you be my GF? Mind, oh my god, oh my god. Tiff, are you there? I understand if you don't like me back. Yes, I will be your GF, Max. Should we go back to the group chat now? Yes. Max and Tiff back to the group chat. Tiff, what is this? Oh, um? Oh, Annie, you were telling the truth? I can't believe it. I broke up with the most precious girl for you. I'm sorry, Annie. I know you won't forgive me. But why, Tiff? Why'd you cheat? I got together with you because you showed me proof of Annie saying rude stuff to you. I hate you, Tiff. That's okay. I still have Max. Let's go, Max. No, I was only with you to get revenge for Annie. Ugh, I hate you all. Bye. I guess it's my time to leave now. Sorry, Annie. Wait, Jack, you can stay. It's not your fault. It's not your fault, Tiff lied. Really? After I trusted Tiff, over you? Yeah, he can stay, right, Max? Of course. They all stay friends and live happily ever. The end. Hey, babe. You there? You're online. Oh my god, what? Can't you tell I'm busy? I'm sorry, I didn't know. I can never do anything when you're around. Stop bothering me. Well, I'm just excited. Excited about what? Ah, uh, never mind. Sorry for disturbing you. Well, sorry isn't going to work. I want the rest of the Robux I asked for. Oh, yes, of course. Wait, how much was it again? Oh, 100k. Wait, what? I swear it was like 10k or something. No, babe. You promised 100k. I can't believe this. It's like you don't even care anymore. I gave you 25k last week. What happened to that? Just give it to me. Well, fine, whatever. 100k Robux from Karina. Thanks, babe. Love you. I love. I can't believe he forgot about our anniversary. Maybe he's just busy and having a stressful day. Hopefully, he members later. Two hours later. Hum, he's online, but his joins are off. That's weird. Oh, Rita is playing Bloxburg. I'll join her. Karina joins. There she is. Is that Larry? Why are they playing together? And why did he have his joins off? Um, I feel bad, but maybe I should spy on them. Babe, you got it all. Yeah, honey, all 125. I could probably get even more. But I should wait a bit. So you made everything seem normal? You said happy anniversary to her and stuff? Anniversary? Oh my god, Larry, did you forget? It's your one year anniversary with her. Oh yeah, forgot about that mail. It it doesn't matter though because she... It doesn't matter. I knew something was wrong. Tell me what the hell is happening here. Um, Karina, calm down. We're just hanging out as friends. Yeah, what are you doing here anyways, Karina? Just friends, yeah, that's okay. So it's fine if I invite Jack here too. Jack, my boyfriend, you can't. Why not? Because he's my boyfriend. You guys don't even talk anyways. And I wouldn't be comfortable with... You talking to another guy, Karina? Um, then I'm not comfortable with you talking to Rita. How's that? You can't control who I'm friends with. I'm actually so annoyed at you for saying this is Karina. You know what I want as an apology? I want? I mean he wants 50k Robux. I'm not giving you anything until you give me a real reason. And if you guys are just friends, why did you call each other Babby and Denis? They're just jokes. Give him the Robux or you clearly don't love him. Karina has added Jack. Kira, I told you not to. Hey, honey. Hi, Jack. Hey, um, he was talking to me? Oh, no, I wasn't. I didn't even see you there, Rita. Babe. Karina, what is this? He's calling you, honey. Yeah, what's wrong? It's just a joke. I thought names like that were okay as jokes. Yeah, but we weren't. Larry, don't. Larry, just tell me the truth. I'll forgive you no matter what. I'll even give you Robux, Dell. Wait, really? Fine. I'll tell you. Larry, don't. Rita and me are together. She makes me get Robux of you. So I can be with her, but actually, you're better so I don't have to use you anymore. OMG. I knew it. Thanks for helping me, Jack. I told you something was going between them. 
Jack, babe, he's lying, I promise. I would never betray you like that. Don't try lie your way out of this. He just exposed you, Mayo. And by the way, Larry, I'm not taking you back. And I'm definitely not giving you any more money. What? What's going on? What do you think's happening? They tricked you into telling the truth. So you admit it was the truth too? No, I, uh, I didn't mean that. I can't believe you, Jack. Are you seriously going to trust some stupid story you heard over me? It's not just a stupid story if you admit it to it. Not only did you both cheat, you used us too. I see it now. You'd always act nice and then ask for something, then you'd just leave. That's not true, babe. No, stop. I'm done, Rita. Goodbye. Fine, I don't even care. I hate you anyways. Sure. Rita has been kicked. Wahaha, that wasn't crazy. Don't act like this isn't your fault too. Karina, listen. I'm sorry I realized how bad I've treated you. Can you forgive me, please? Are you only saying that because Rita's gone? And I'm your only other option? No, no, of course not. I'm being serious, Karina. Okay, then. I guess I can forgive you. Um, Wait, what? really? No. Larry has been kicked. OMG, I actually thought you were. Taking him back for a sec. Never, not after what he did. Well, thanks for helping me, Jack. I'm sorry about Rita. It's okay, thanks. So, do you want to stay friends? Oh yeah, of course. Kira and Jacob stay friends. And never heard from the others again. The end. What is this? 100? Warning, if her words goes to zero, you will get banned. And if not, then are safe. Oh fuck, I don't want to get banned. Mind, Mind shit, shit, I gotta, I gotta save, save my words. My words. Mind, Mind him a go, go to, to that, that to see that how many, many words, words did he did get. get. Baha ha, it's fun playing MM2. For real. It's Indy24 has joined the GC. Hi, Andy O. Babe, you only got nine too. Nuts. Um, but how am I supposed to talk to you if you only 92? This is gonna be boring. Hey, it's okay. If he only got 92. You just don't know. It's boring if he's not talking. Andy just speak nothing will happen. Are you dumb? Excuse me. Didn't you heard the warning? The warning said if our word goes to zero, we will get banned. Guys, stop. Do you want your BF to get banned? Ye, I mean no. Guys, stop. Shut the fuck up, Harry. Hey, don't be rude to my bab. I mean Harry. I don't care, Andy. Private chat me right now. In the private chat. Take this. Ruby123 donated 10 meters words to its Sandy24. Oh my god, Ruby, I can't take this. No, take it. I'm tired seeing you suffering. Oh, thank you so much. You are the best friend I ever had. Why did you say yes to Rose? She's literally a pick-me bitch. Because I love her. Well, she doesn't love you. She's using you and didn't you see how she react about your words? I know Ruby, but I can break up with her. I just want to feel I just, I just want to feel someone's love. I'm already used to it. But she's using you, Andy. I said I'm already used to it. I'm grateful to you for giving me a words. Now it's not the right time for us to fight. Let's go back to GC. Okay. In GC. Kissing. It's Indy24 has joined the GC. Ruby123 has joined the GC. What the fuck are you two doing? Oh, I'm nothing. Andy, what are you doing? Just standing there look at what's your girlfriend doing. I know, you saw them kissing speak. W, we are not kissing. Then explain why is your hand on Rose's waist? Just admitted Rose, you're using Andy, and you're cheating on him. You Rose, you are nothing but a fucking cheater and a liar. And you Harry, what kind of a friend are you? I knew you two are off to something. Oh, come on, don't be a melodramatic. And I only dated you, Andy, because I like Harry. And, yeah, Ruby, you're right, I'm using him. And, Andy, we're over you, don't even have enough words. I guess you haven't seen my words yet. Wait, how did you get 10 meters words? Ruby gave me some unlike you. You didn't even give me a words. I'll give you words and let's get back together. Wait, what? You get off me, Harry. Are you for real? Yes, I don't even like you. Well, just well. Law, you deserve it. So, Andy? You know, I ain't getting back at you. I can't believe that I let you use me. I just can't move. I'm not the right person for every girl. So, 
I will stop from being in a relationship from now on. Bye, Rose. Bye, Harry. It's Indy 24 has kicked Ross at MP from the GC. It's Indy 24 has kicked Harry 90 from the GC. The end. Story but the main character has a brain. Isn't an assault sensitive Andy met you three minutes ago. I love you girl. Why am I getting so much notifications? In the group chat. To be honest, I think Audrey is wrong. Hello guys, how are you? Oh, hi Jinx, doing great I guess. I'm also fine, what are you doing? I don't know. Saw so many notifications. So I wanted to check what was happening. What about you? Just chilling I guess. Can I join you, kinda bored lol. Well, we were all brutal leave anyways. We were going to the movie theater. Why didn't you invite me? You know I love watching movies. Well, kinda of boring with you to be honest. Bruh. What did you say? You know what? I'm done with your odd. Just left like always. I will check up on you boyfriend. In DMs. Hey Jaden. Hey love, how are you? Not at my best point right now. Why? Same thing again. Fiora and Lexi left me again. <coughs> I'm having enough of the zone-sided relationship I have with them. Since Audrey came, I don't know. It seems like everything we built fell apart. I already told you. They're just using your attention and for Audrey. Well, nothing. Bruh. But I'm here for you. We can cuddle if you want. Yes, I'm coming at your place. At his place. I missed you so much. Me too, let's just have the greatest time. What? Who is it? Oh, it's Audrey. Why do you have her number? I don't know. Didn't know she had mine. But how do you know it was her? If you didn't know she had your number? Well, um... You know what, I'm sick of this. Audrey is the center awful the attention. My friends and now you. I came to feel better, not to feel bitter. Have fun, I'm leaving. No but babe. In the group chat. Girls. What do you want, Jaden? I need to tell you some eating. What is it? Our plan failed. <coughs> what, what, what happened? Our plan, so I cannot have my Gucci bag. Ugh. Not the bag, Fiora. Are you stupid? Bruh. Yes, I think she is to be honest. That sucks, she left. Yep. Well then, I think we'll have to. With Jinx. I'm so sick of why is she here? Why am I jealous of her? But my boyfriend, what is he hiding from? I hate this. I wish love was easier to understand. I wish it was like it old days. Where me, Elle and Lily were good friends. I regret this, I need a change. What do you think is happening? Is she getting betrayed? Is she losing her love? Does her friends hide something from her? Babe, come on. Answer me. It's been three days. Jinx, I love you. I don't want to break anything. I need you. I'm here. Oh my god, baby. Missed you. Yeah, yeah. Bruh. Anyways, gotta go. Okay. She went outside. I will go to the grocery store. Oh, isn't that Jaden with Audrey? I should probably get going. You know what? No, time for a change. What are you doing with her? I thought I could trust you. Am I not allowed to go out? <coughs> you went your way. I won't be alone just because you are acting like a baby. But since you are always right, <coughs> I was just walking with her, happy? Also, sometimes you should shut your pretty mouth of yours. I know you don't like me. Audrey. Let's play the what's the lie game. Should we break up or you tell me the truth? No, okay. You want the truth? The truth is, I've been booking us a trip. Even though Audrey don't seem to be your bestest friend, she still helped me to pick the right trip according to your likes and dislikes. Oh my god, really? Yeah, big attitude of you don't think this of your boyfriend. Anyways, I'm coming back home. I love you. With Fyra and Lexi. By the way, what waste plan you were talking about? The Gucci one? Yeah. Well, it's Jaden he wanted to give it me. What is happening? Is Jaden really that clean? Is Jinx wrong? Only one way to find out. But why would Jaden give you a Gucci bag? When he is already with... Audrey! Oh, you're so stupid. I'm talking about Jinx. Bruh. Oh, sorry, kind of disconnected. I can see that. But if the original plan fail, are we still faking to hate Jinx? I told you there's a reason why we should hate her. What is it? I can't tell you. Why though? Hum, because Jaden will tell you. It's not me, it's him. Whatever. With Jinx. Even though I should be happy. I don't know, I don't trust Audrey. What's her problem with me? Why did Fiora at her? I don't know anything about her and yet I'm jealous of her. I should maybe spy on my boyfriend. I'm sure he wasn't saying the truth. Outside. Know how much I love you. I love you too, please don't leave me. Are you serious? You're really cheating on me with Audrey? Jinx. What's the problem with that? 
You left me behind. I needed someone, not a bish. So, I was just an amusement toy for you. So, you think you can play with my feelings? But at least I'm going to thank you. Now, I won't embarrass myself with someone. That is no fashion style. But you're losing something. She left. Well, one problem solved. In DMs with Lexi? Lexi, I need. I need an answer. Come online and answer me now. What do you want? You knew that Jaden was cheating on me? Oh, uh, yeah. And you couldn't tell me. So I am shitty to you and Fyra. So you think I don't have the right to know what is happening. By the way, you said Audrey was wrong. <coughs> but I said nothing again. Why did you change? What happened to us? Where is Miet now? Since you became bestie with Fyra or friends with Audrey, you've been mean to me. And like a stupid person, I always forgave you. I never left you because I thought you would maybe have some pity for me. Maybe feel bad, but you didn't. So tell me what was all of this? I don't even know why I did this. I'm sorry. So, are you going to explain to me what was all of this? I would like to. What am I saying? There could be no reason to treat me like this. You just wanted me to suffer, didn't you? Well, farewell. I'm sorry. With Audrey and Fyora. So now you got what you wanted, huh? You got your boyfriend. You broke someone else's heart. What do we do now? I told you, I'm not satisfied enough. I really wanted to post it. That would have been a giant hit. More money, more videos. We just had to learn Jaden's face though. I'm so stupid, why did I call you in? Bruh. I misclipped on my phone. I wanted to send him a message. It didn't work, but at least Jinx's heart is broken so we got what we wanted to do. Yeah, with Jaden. Even though I like Audrey, <clears throat> though it was such a crazy plan to fake a relationship with her, if I tell her the truth she would leave me. I don't want to think about it. Why did I agree on this stupid plan? In the end, it's horrible to do that. With Fyra and Lexi? Lexi, I hope you said nothing about our plan to Jinx. I didn't. Good. Now, I want an answer. What's the reason behind all of this? You know what, fine. She cheating on Jaden. What? Remember when me and Jinx went to a party? Yeah. I caught her sleeping with another guy. You know, all of these stupid details. So you wanted to ruin her reputation just because she cheated on Jaden? Um, kind of, yeah. I have to tell her, it's not Jinx. I can't believe she did that. She loves Jaden too much. No, don't. Bye, I can't. What is happening? Is Juvia really that wrong? What is Audrey, Jaden, and Lexi really hiding? Are you so lonely that you have to fake something? What the hell? What are you doing here? Don't say more. Happy that you broke a couple. Gulping won't makes you better anyways. Where are the proofs that I cheated? Well, here. She show video. That's not me, girl. I literally have a butterfly tattoo on my back. Oh, sh t. <clears throat> what did I miss? Oh, babe, you're back. Babe, what? You, you heard, heard us. us. Audrey came. Oops, sorry, girly. You were part of this? I don't know, was I? I think so. Yeah, I think so, too. I knew you were jealous of me. That's why we planned to trick you. I didn't know you would go that far. To even fake a video of me with another guy. Being a bish one makes you better. I, I am sorry, please forgive me. Also, cut the act. We all know you're forcing your voice. But that was fun seeing you cracking your voice lol. What? How did you know? That's literally the most obvious thing. That was so cringe. But what happened to our call, Audrey? When you were with Jaden and even said I love you to him. Do you know what acting is? So, everything in our relation is fake. Yup, exactly. Just don't come with your I trusted you thing. You are a nobody now. Thank you, next. The end. Roblox stories, but the main character has a brain. Babe. What? Can I add? No. Okay. Luke added Mandy and Sophie to the chat. Hi. Hi. Lisa removed Mandy and Sophie. What the F? Boy, I literally just said no. Can you please let me add them? No. Please. Boy, I said no, now shut the F up. Whatever. Luke add Mandy and Sophie to group chat. Lisa removed Mandy and Sophie to group chat. Stop. Why should I? Because they want to be friends with you. More like they want to date you behind my back or something. No, they won't. Now let me add them. No. Why are you being so stubborn? Why aren't you letting me have a choice? My father's going to sue you. Okay. Can you please let me? Oh my god, fine, you're so annoying. Thank you, baby girl. Luke added Mandy and Sophie. Hey, I'm Sophie and this is my little sister Mandy. Hi. You she's an emo like Sophie? 
I know, right? What the F, Luke? What? It's just a boost up the mood. Yeah, emo girl. Mandy, stop. First of all, I'm not an emo. Second of all, Luke looks more emo than all of us. No, I don't. Not going to lie, you kind of do. Don't say that to my Luke, baby. Mandy, you're literally 16. Yeah, I'm 16. It's obvious you're lying about your age, girly. And that's my boyfriend you're calling baby there. He's literally mine. And I can prove it to you that I'm 16. Okay, let's all do a face reveal then. Ugh, fine. Let's see who's uglier. I'll go first, then this is me. Boy, isn't that Yeonjin from TXD? Oh yeah, sorry, my bad. This is me. We can't even see your face. I don't care. Hot hands though, babe. Excuse me. Mandy, he has a girlfriend. It's okay, she can call me that. What the F? Okay, moving on. This is me, I guess. So pretty. Nice. Ugly? Girl, I don't give a shit about what you say. Okay, I guess it my my turn. What, my turn? What? This is me? So hot. Mandy, that's literally my face. No. It's Adi's face, stop lying, Sophie. Shut up, Luke. Show us your real face, Mandy. This is my real face. No, it's mine, Mandy's lying. I'm not lying. Mandy, if you don't stop, I'll expose you. Don't you break our promise, Sophie. Stop fighting, you all. It's getting really annoying. Honestly, I didn't want this drama in the first place. But Luke forced me to add you all. Ugh, shut up, I never did that. A uh, yes, you win. But still, it's my face and not Sophie's. Why would you believe a liar like her? It's okay, Mandy, I believe you. Shut up, Luke. Please show your real face, Mandy. This is as funny. Oh my god, literally you see my face every morning. And it looks like that, so why are you lying? Look at stop pretending you're a fool. So you could get a hot boyfriend on Roblox. I'm not oh my god, I'm 16. Okay, stop. Mandy, how about we facetomy? What? If that's your actual face, let's facetomy. Hum, I? Just do it, Mandy. Fine, I'll do it. They call video facetomy. Hey, this isn't Mandy, this is Sophie. Sophie lied she gave me her phone and threatened me to say that. You are Mandy. Can you show her face now? No, she'll kill me. Let's just say she's actually 6 and not 16. Let's just act like you believe her so she won't beat me up. All right. Do you believe me now? Yeah, yeah, whatever fat bish. Haha, <laughs> beat that Sophie. Sophie sends screen recording to Luke. What? I've been wanting to date a 6 years old. What? You wanted to cheat. How did you know that I'm 6? Honestly, I sensed this beforehand. I hate you so much, Sophie. You are a horrible piece of sheet, and I hope you gets no girl. Why are you even my sister? I hope our parents announce that you're adopted. You're also manipulated. No one deserves your ugly AZZ. Your face is ugly anyway. Your face is ugly too. I should have broken up with you sooner. Oh my me, I'm leaving. We're breaking up. Lisa removed Luke and Mandy out of group chat. Wow, that was a chaotic fight. Also, are you okay? You just broke up with your boyfriend. Girls, I'm fine. I was the one who broke up with him. So I don't feel anything at all. Honestly, I didn't even want to Lyme date at all. Luke forced me to do it. I'm so sorry. It's alright. Hey, wanna meet up sometime? Of course, I'd love to. This Sunday? Sure. Skip to Sunday. Hey, Lisa. Oh, hey, Sophie. Let's hang out at the park. Yeah, sure. And for that day, they start hanging out of a couple of day. Hey, Lisa. Yeah, Soppy, what wrong? I want to tell you something. What is it? Will you be my? Will you be my? I'll think about it later off. Why would you take Pop Idol's kidnap me? Am I in a Wattpad story right now? No, we saved your life. From what? That girl. Yes, she was going to kill you. No, dude, wrong sentence. Oh, she was going to manipulate you like that, Luke, dude. Gasp. Unfriend her before it's too late. Stop acting goofy, Tayin. I'm not. I'm going to choose PS5 over you next time. No, please. No PS5 is better than you. No, I'm better. No PS5 is. Like, stop it. To be continued.